For the next seven days, Russia will undertake massive military drills along with troops of at least 12 countries, including China and India. The drills mark increasingly close defense ties between Moscow and Beijing. The week-long exercises, which began today, is set to end on September 7th. It comes amid simmering tensions with the West over Russia's invasion of Ukraine. The visuals on your screens right now are of the opening ceremony released by the Russian Defense Ministry. These exercises to be held at seven firing ranges in Russia's Far East and the Sea of Japan would involve more than 50,000 troops, more than 5,000 weapons units, 140 aircraft and 60 warships from different nations. Today is a significant event for our countries, for our armed forces. The strategic command and staff exercise Vostok 2022 begins. An event of this magnitude is unique in many ways. The scope of the exercises, the composition of the participating states, the number of personnel, weapons and special military equipment involved indicates the increased role and importance of the joint training of our armed forces. The Russian ministry said that units of Russian airborne troops, long-range bombers and military cargo planes will also take part in the drills in which several ex-Soviet nations and countries like China, Laos, Mongolia, Nicaragua and Syria are taking part. The Indian Ministry of External Affairs has said that India has been participating in such multilateral military drills in Russia. This even as the US has expressed concerns over other countries' participation in these exercises. India has been regularly participating in multilateral exercises um, in Russia um, along with a number of other countries. I understand there will be only army uh, participation in the Vostok exercises uh, this year.